welcome all in this video we are going to talk about cold cutting we are going to cover what is cold cutting why cold cutting is required advantages of cold cutting types of cold cutting machines types of pipe cold cutting machines and along with few examples so these are the topics which we are going to cover in this video along with that there is a link in the description box for quiz so let us start with the topic now let us see what is cold cutting cold cutting can be defined as a material cutting procedure without using any flame or heat or you can say without producing any kind of spark right so this is totally different from traditional cutting where we used to use the flame and heat to produce cuts now cold cutting process is one of the safest method for cutting pipes plates and structures especially in hazardous environments okay so this is a term which is uh, which makes this cold cutting very useful especially in hazardous environments so this is the definition that we are cutting without using any flame spark or any heat now why this cold cutting is preferred first is safety the absence of any heat makes it very safe right it is safe for operators also so that means what we are trying to say when we are cutting we are cutting in a safe environment so that means not only operators but we can utilize this confidently in hazardous environments also so this is safe for both then money again uh, we have to have some economical procedures so cold cutting is the cheaper as compared to hot cuttings right it takes less time so one it is cheaper second it takes less time so that means it makes it more economical right so these two are the major benefits first it is safe second it is economical now let us look at few of the advantages of cold cutting okay first of all there is no heat involved that means there will be no heat effective zone when there is no heat affected zone that means we'll be getting improved material properties mechanical properties will be improved defects will be lesser which are associated with heat affected zone so once there is no heat affected zone so associated defects will not be there elimination of dangers now we know this is safer as compared to hot cutting there will be flame involved in hot cutting which is not there in the cold cutting so that means that makes it safer it is fast and quick operation there will be fast and quick that means we are saving time and money right elimination of difficult and laborious hand grinding process right process to create weld ready surface when we are not doing any kind of welding there is no heat affected zone we don't have to maintain or we and we don't have to prepare the surfaces for that right which again saves a lot of time and it makes the cold cutting operator operation cost effective right so that means what we are saying it is not only safe it is saving a lot of laborious efforts when we don't have to prepare the surfaces for example if we have to do some welding we have to prepare the surfaces ready for welding right when there is no fire there is no chance of explosion that means it makes it more safer no airborne contaminations when there is no fire no heat no flame is there then it is airborne contamination will not be there no spark and flame which makes it safer no hot work permit requirements right it again saves a lot of time if we are going for welding we we need to take a lot of uh, permits also so that means it is safer it is time taking less pollution ready to uh, perform quick and safe so these are few of the advantages of cold cutting now let us talk about the types of cold cutting machines first of all based on drive drive mechanism we can classify this as a pneumatic or hydraulic right a pneumatic one we can call them as air driven cold cutting machines also so this is classification based on drive mechanism 
then we can classify these machines as per their popularity for example clamshell lathe split flame cutters clamshell lathe or clamshell cutters these are the categories types of pipe cold cutting machines also based on size and capability of these machines we can classify them as low profile cold cutters mid size pipe cold cutting machines heavy duty cold pipe cutting machines the name itself is talking about how these are related to size and capability for example if we say mid size pipe okay we are not talking about small we are not talking about heavy but mid size right and their capability they are going to perform the cold cutting for mid pipe sizing size pipes if cold cutting machines are there we call them mid size pipe cold cutting machine so this these are few of the types or you can say the basis of categorizing the cutting machines now let us have a look at examples of cold cutting machines so that we can understand what we are talking about let us look at few of the examples of cold cutting machines right there are so many other machines available but out of these clamshell cutter machine is widely used especially for pipe cutting so let us see what is the basis and the principle behind all these machines out of these we are taking three examples so that we can visualize how and what type of cutters are there clamshell pipe cutter it is a portable pipe cold cutting machine okay this is basic uh, behind this this is portable and mostly it is used for cutting and beveling the pipes so this is very much commonly used cutter especially for cutting and beveling pipes so bevel ends we can make by cold cutters called clam shell pipe cutters now there are band saws diamond wire saws these are also widely used in chemical industry and most of the time these are used where high precision cutting is not a requirement okay so when this kind of requirement is not there we can always go with band saws and diamond wire saws again there is another abrasive water jet cutting this is used for uh, cutting when we are having a risk of fire and explosion right so this is the requirement when this kind of environment is there we can go with abrasive water jet cutting so these are the types of cutting machines cold cutting machines especially for pipes so in this video we talked about cold cutting what is cold cutting why cold cutting is used advantages types types of cold cutting machines especially for pipes and we talked about few examples along with that there is a link for quiz which is given in the description box so don't forget uh, to look at various links especially related to courses and quizzes so thank you for watching see you in the next part